An ultra-low freezer we like to call ULT, or ultra-low temperature freezer, that allow temperatures to drop as low as 80 to 90 degrees below zero Celsius. The freezer gets very cold, so we're standing in a hallway right now, Zach, where it's about 20 degrees Celsius. Minus 80 is 100 degrees colder than that. So if you can equate freezing water versus boiling water, that's the difference between the air inside that freezer and the air we're breathing at room temperature right now. Science. The reason for ultra low temperature is to maintain the integrity of very, very important labile items, which means they're very prone to degradation. So things like mRNA, for example, that everybody knows about because of the Pfizer vaccine and the Moderna vaccine, those items are very prone to degrade. So by keeping everything cold, it stops the molecular movements that might cause degradation of those uh, strands of mRNA. Some things need to be stored colder than, than others because basically they're less stable. Molecules vibrate and the more they're vibrating, the more they can degrade. So if you can get them down to minus 50, minus 60, minus 80, they'll preserve longer. If you open the freezer right now in, in my lab and you put your hand on it, on the, on the inside, it would stick to the inside within seconds. You're looking at minus 40, minus 50, I think, in the Antarctica. Here you're, you're 20, 30 degrees lower than that. So right now we're in my lab, my students are working in the background. We've been basically looking at immune responses in people that were infected with the virus back in the spring. Now of course we're hoping to look at the antibody responses to the vaccines that are going to be rolled out. It was ironic to see that suddenly everybody in the world was trying to get their hands on things that you know, we just use to keep stuff cold. Well, if regular objects are chilled that cold, depending on the composition of the object, it can do different things. So things do get more brittle, uh, more breakable kind of, as, as they get colder and colder. Given the fact that the mRNA vaccine story was on the go a little early in this as one of the key and maybe quicker ways to combat this epidemic, in the back of our minds we knew that ultra-low temperature freezers would definitely be a part of this story.